Hello, Glam Squad, and welcome back to my channel. It's Gigi. We're going to do a very short video today. Uh, I'm struggling with these new glasses. I have a headache. Now, I'm just showing you here. Um, I'm just mixing this up a little. This is some polish from Elite 99, uh, and it's that periwinkle color. That is the 2022 Pantone color of the year. Uh, something periwinkle. I forget the exact name of it. I'll have it written down. I'll, I'll put it up here. Um, that's the reason I decided to use this color. We're going to do all three of the nails that color. I'm only doing three nails today. Uh, I My creativity is at a low. And I struggled with this set all afternoon and evening yesterday. I mean hours, you guys. Uh, what I'm doing is a little mushroom, a little winter mushroom. Uh, it's going to be a little twofer, a little two mushrooms here. I just made their little mushroom heads. Now I'm coming in with some brown and I'm adding it to this cream color I'm using. These are both by Model Ones. And I'm just making a, a little bit of a lighter brown color. And now I'm making it even a little lighter because what I want to do right now is make the stems. And I just want the stems to be a tiny bit their own color, but not too dissimilar to the actual mushroom. Now coming in with that original brown we made, I'm just making a line that indicates the ground. And then I'm using that same brown to outline the mushrooms. And this is not only gonna give them a little definition, but it's gonna give us a little bit of brown to play with in just a moment, which you will see. Guys, I, seriously, uh, yesterday I could not make anything work. I hate these glasses. I'm going to take them back and instead of do bifocals, um, the, the eye doctor told me that my eyes are really not that bad um, and that it was really up to me if I wanted to wear the glasses all the time or just when I'm reading. So why I need a bifocal for that, I don't know, because really when I'm looking through the glasses, now here I'm coming with my ombre brush and just shadowing that brown line a little bit into the uh, mushroom to give some shading and a little bit more of a natural look to the actual surface of the mushroom. Because usually mushrooms are not just a solid color, there's a little, a little variation in their color. Also going to just come here and shade a little on that ground line we made. <sighs> now on the other two nails, I'm going to do a quick top coat here. And this is a non-white top coat. If you use, Jacob, please stop barking. If you use a top coat that has a tacky layer, make sure you wipe that off after you pull it out of the lamp because otherwise it's going to mess up our next step, which is a very simple and easy next step. We're not going to uh, add a whole ton more to this set. We're gonna we're gonna keep it simple. Uh, now here we're gonna add a tiny bit of snow on top of our mushrooms and a little bit right there on the ground and up against the side of our mushroom, just to indicate it is indeed a winter mushroom. Now I'm gonna come in with some more of that top coat and. I'm just going to make some very thin lines. A couple of them, I'm going to wide them out a little bit toward one end. And this is just going to really give us the indication of the wind blowing. I'm not really sure how well this played out, but I like the glitter I used. It's a steely sort of silver color, and it just, to my mind, gives the idea of cold weather of it just being very chilly outside, the wind cutting through the air, and it helps reinforce the idea that these are little winter mushrooms. You see, isn't that a pretty glitter? It's silver, but there's a steely sort of gray to it, and, and I really appreciate that tone to the, to the silver. So it just reminded me of the idea of wind, and whereas normally you might use white, I, the white I have has pink and green in it, so it didn't really work. 
guys, these are the nails. I hope that you like them. I'm sorry I didn't do a full five. Please forgive me. We are going to see you on Friday for something else I hope amazing. So stay tuned for that. Make sure you click all my buttons. We're going to see you then. Bye-bye.